Hello, hello. I am once again back on Scott Rail, just now leaving Edinburgh Waverly, headed up to Inverness this morning. Can go see if I can catch a glimpse of the Loch Ness Monster. So I made it up to Inverness and the sun is actually shining. Funny thing that because about a week and a half ago when my trip was originally planned to come up here, my journey was canceled. And that's because all of the rail lines were flooded from so much pouring rain over a 48 hour period or so. So none of the trains could make it up this far north cause just because there was so much water on the tracks. But I'm here now though and the first order of business is actually to head right next door to the bus station so I can pick up my ticket for tomorrow's adventures. Just taking a taxi here to the hotel where I'll be staying for the next two nights and I was welcomed by some Christmas decorations here and in fact they're putting up the Christmas tree as I speak right now at the Bunchrew House Hotel, just a stunning, stunning location. Got a feeling I'm gonna like it here. It is now the following morning after arriving here at Buntru yesterday evening. And I must say, the lay of the land looks quite a bit different here in the morning now that the tide has gone out. We have a lone swan swimming out there. The weather conditions right now are pretty good and they're gonna be okay today from what I understand. So right now I'm just waiting on a taxi that's gonna take me back out to the Inverness city center. And from there, I'll catch a bus that'll take me out to Loch Ness, where I'll be spending my day. And my taxi has just arrived. Made it inside of the castle walls here at Urquhart Castle on Loch Ness. Guys, you can just see miles and miles in any direction that you look. This place is such a cool piece of Scottish history. And I think the first order of business is actually to climb the tower behind me. That's Grant Tower and see what the view is like from up there.
Time to take a dip. If Nessie's out there, she didn't want to come out to play today, sadly. And that's going to do it for my time here at Urquhart Castle. So it's time to head back up to the bus stop and back to Inverness. Back in Inverness now, and I have to say, I never imagined myself inside of a Scottish mall, but it is almost Christmas, so if there's ever a good time to beat a mall, I suppose this is the time of year. My time here in Inverness has come to a close. It is now the morning of checkout here at the Bunkaroo House Hotel. Can't say enough about how lovely and wonderful the staff have been during my stay. A great all-around experience. And if I'm ever back in the Inverness area, I will be coming back here for sure. But it's time to head back towards the city center now and catch a train down to Edinburgh.